Yeah. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Rick Ball coming at you again with yet another classic. If you don't know what I'm doing, I'm making sure I cover each and every NBA game to provide you with up-to-date sports analysis, as well as my opinion on these games. Now, everybody knows about the NBA's most coveted MVP award, and it's usually used to co cover and decorate the most NBA elite players, the Michael Jordans, the, the Magic Johnsons, and so on and so on. I forget who else uh, won all these, uh, the Kobe Bryants. I mean, sometimes they even get, they even, they fall off and they give Steve Nash the MVP over Shaquille O'Neal. And we get that and understand that. And sometimes they give Carl Malone the MVP over Michael Jordan when we know he could have won the MVP every year, just like a LeBron. But where I draw the line is all of these analytics and all of these new age ways, wages, uh, ways to grade and scale players, uh, these current players against the old time players. Uh, when there's no analytic to measure heart or measure grit and, and will. Um, one thing I, I'm, one thing I'm just a little bit irritated about is Nikola Jokic winning his second MVP award consecutive, by the way. Just like a Steph Curry winning his second, he had won consecutive MVPs, but he did the second one unanimously. Like, are you telling me he's better than Steph Curry is better than Michael Jordan or he was better than LeBron James? No, he's not. And Nikola Jokic to me, he's not even better than Joel Embiid. I, I need you guys to really chime in on this and tell me what you guys think. Because at this point for me now, I'm thinking the NBA MB MVP award is just a big joke. And it's, uh, it's just, they just choose who they want to choose. And it has nothing to do about, uh, you know, the player, win percentage. Uh, and, uh, and impact on the game and everything like that. Cause I mean, come on, man. I mean, I'm just, this is just too much. Let me guys know what you guys think. It's your boy Rick One Ball. Like, comment, subscribe. If you talking shit, you betting on your life. For real. Nigga, fist nigga, I got the knife. <laughs> Whoa. You know I got the revolver, problem solver. <laughs> Look, you went to Harvard cause I thought you 